Hey man, Jesse Shredder. I don't know where you at, but you're late. You're gone, you missed it. Too nice to y'all. Now I got up price for y'all. Snake eyes on dice for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all. Frozen. A6 all the hay. I won't get involved today. Is a block of mac and cheese. A block of mac and cheese. Ew. Ew. That looks really strange. Except for that one stray piece of pasta that looks pretty good. Is it done? Mm -hmm. No. It needs like another minute or something. Okay, so I'm not going to taste it until it's done. I didn't tell you to taste it. I said to get a video. You're doing progress, aren't you? No. I'm about to try this uh, Trader Joe's. What is it called? Vegan Mac, Vegan Mac. You got it. Wow. My senses are spot on. It tastes exactly what I smell. It smells sweet, like, um, almost like sweet potato or pumpkin. Pumpkin, that's what it is. It's pumpkin. I wonder what the ingredients say. Butternut, oh, butternut squash, that's what it is. It's not pumpkin, it's bu the butternut squash cake. It's actually not bad, but it's like sweetish. Not like sugary sweet, but like you could have that, it has like a hint of sweetness, and it's not <laughs> mac and cheesy. I mean, it has like a slight cheesy taste. It reminds me of ravioli with butternut squash, not mac and cheese but it has like a creamy mac and cheese texture. It's not freaking funny. Stop laughing at me. You just can't stop talking. I can't stop talking. Sorry, but that's that's my thoughts on the, on that. Let me, try, let me try it again, hold on. Definitely there's, squashy. There's no, there's no cheesy flavor to it. It just, um. It, it definitely needs some nooch, some nutritional yeast. Yeah, all you taste is like soup, like a squash, butternut squash. The texture's on point, it's the flavor that's not. Nutritional yeast. Yeah, so I feel like that would be pretty good with like a side of asparagus with some vegan butter, some garlic sauce or something. But by itself, all right. Let's see what, let's see if the nooch cheesed it up. Oh yeah, that works. And some salt. And some salt. Some nutritional yeast, some salt. Still a little off. I feel like throwing a little bit of, no, throwing a little bit of, um, Fire life cheddar would probably make this a lot better. Oh, that rhymed. That's your boy, Jesse Shrek. Leave on a high note. Peace. You're a loser. <laughs> I completely forgot that I bought this Wayfair cheddar. So we're gonna taste it out first and then we'll decide if we should put it into the mac and cheese. And this I did not get at Trader Joe's. That I did. Yeah, you probably need to melt this before I eat dinner. Come on, Otis. Otis, come on. So I'm not a dog person, but the worst part about walking the dog is after they poop and you get that wind, you get that whiff. Gross. God, I love cats. I love cats. You just poop in a box, be done with it. Mm -hmm.